Good morning my lovelies. So as promised I am going to show you what I've bought when we were away in Cotswolds, mostly from Aspiga. Um, this is new as well. This is from Monsoon. Um, I really really like it. This is um, linen mix so I think it's viscose and linen so it shouldn't crease as much. It's a off-white camisole with really lovely cutout and it has like a scalloped edge can you see so that's really nice i really really like this one remember when i got one of those camisoles from zara that was lean and quite similar but it didn't feel properly fit properly so i feel like this one fits much better and also um i've tried it on with a normal bra because I've got stra strapless bra right now on um, I've tried it with normal bra and the straps go sort of fit just under this strap so you could wear it with normal bra especially when it's white bra you always ask me about my strapless bras let me just get them so the ones that I always wear is this one it's with detachable straps but they don't sell these or do them anymore i swear i've looked everywhere i found maybe last year on some odd websites leftovers of this bra it was from ultimo and it was called wow oh my god wow bra or something like this i can't remember now it doesn't say on here the name of it and this the first time i bought this bra i swear it was 10 years ago um and i love it so much it's my favorite strapless bra so i've bought i think i've got five of or six of those so they should last me for the rest of my life i did find then quite a good one on amazon I don't think oh yeah this one must have come with straps as well but i took them off uh this is really really nice bra i don't like it as much as the other one but it's still a really nice bra so i'll leave you a link to that one um yeah but the ones that i wear are no longer available okay and the next thing don't laugh so what shop was it in? Office, I think. I saw this. So you know how uh, these um, really chunky slider sandals are in fashion? I don't like the Birkenstocks at all. Although I like some of the ones that are a bit more delicate and I quite like the rubber ones. The really light ones in different colours. But I don't think they are very flattering. Anyway, I saw these. <laughs> And I thought to myself, well, these are kind of ugly. You see those everywhere. And they are like rubber. And this is almost like a scuba fabric. Sort of foamy, like scuba diving suit. Really soft, really lovely. And I thought... They are quite ugly, but they look very comfortable. So I tried them on and oh, they are so comfortable. They are like walking on cloud. And actually they don't look that bad. Let me just move back and hopefully you can see them. Yeah, I don't think they look that bad, but they are the most comfortable, spongy sliders ever. Uh, oh, and they are from Tom's. They do them in different colours. Um, I've seen really pretty sort of mint green and like pale pink. So I don't know, maybe I'll be buy some more. They, they do them in black as well. But you have to search for them around in different shops. Okay, let me now show you the stuff from Aspiga. Okay, so <laughs> this is first of two dresses. They are the same. This is Tabitha. Tabitha dress. I love, love this dress. So the fabric you need to look for is 
Eco Vero. I will put it on a screen because they do Tabitha dress as well in just that cotton. They do this really, really thin, almost like a gauze type of cotton. Um, but it doesn't have the same movement and the weight. It's just heavenly. I had a bit of a trouble to do my own because you have to tie these um, ties here. Um, you can see as well on the models that they make the bow a bit further at the back and that looks nice as well. So you can have the bows on the top of your shoulders or a bit at the back. This is in size medium and they say size medium is UK 12, US 8. Uh, so, but I think if you are my size, which I am between 10 and 12, 6 and 8, um, in the US sizes and your boobs are like even up to D I would say you probably could get away with small because there is plenty room here you just have to take in con to consideration this because the back is stretchy sheared but this panel isn't and I really like it because I don't know if you've got big boobs when you get the sheared, you know, that gathered panel here, it makes your bob, bobs look bigger. And most dresses actually in that shape make me look really big. But I really like, because I suppose this doesn't go right under, it sort of skims here, it doesn't make my bobs so you know looking really huge so I really love it I just love the fit of it so I've got it on right now with my high heel shoes from Zara but this dress is fine for me with flats I'm five foot five I know that they do Tabitha but not every pattern because you will see this dress in different patterns they do couple in petite as well. This one doesn't come in petite, but you could easily turn it up if you've got someone that could do it for you easily. So this is, you see with these high heels, but I will show you in a second um, without. But this just moves so beautifully. I just love. I still haven't worn it because the weather's been atrocious here, so I'm just gonna wear it around the house, I think. Okay, so look now if I take the heels off. You see, it's not almost dragging on the floor, but I suppose I could tie these a bit higher, um, the straps, and you'll be just right. So this is the pink and red. Um, this fabric doesn't really crease much. And if it does, once you hang it, it sort of goes really lovely. So fabulous for traveling, for just packing in your suitcase. So yeah, it's really, really nice because it doesn't crease. Now let me put on the blue because the blue is gorgeous as well. Okay, so here is the blue and this one had the straps already quite shorter. And look, that's what I mean. Sort of tied more in the back. This one is such a gorgeous color as well. I am so glad that I got to see the actual store because you know sometimes with the colors they might look very vibrant on the website but when you get it in real life they are not so vi vibrant but I would say the website is very accurate especially each piece of clothing has a model, a video of a model walking in it and you can really see it so the website is really good when it comes to the accuracy for the colors. So yeah, it's the same dress, just different color. I think it is called cheetah, this, um, this uh, fabric, this pattern. I absolutely love it. It is so, so lovely. So remember, if you want this fabric, because obviously they do other dresses in the same pattern, but they might be cotton so they do that cheetah i think as well in cotton and those ones won't be as 
vibrant because the cotton is a bit thinner and see-through. Uh, still quite vibrant but not as vibrant as this. So if you want this fabric that moves so lovely and hangs really nicely is Eco Vero, I think it's called. It's a sustainable viscose type of fabric. So I told, I show, I've shown you these um, shorts, the linen shorts. They are a bit loose on my waist, but you know, usual problem. But I really, really like the shape of them. I told you because they are quite narrow here. A lot of linen shorts are really flappy like a skirt and um, they are not very flattering on me. So I think they did these in khaki and navy as well. And these are those little tops. So, so this is the cotton, really, really thin. Um, it's quite see-through, but when you've got the patent one, you can't see anything. I will show you the white one in a minute. Um, it's more see-through. But I wanted to talk to you about the sizes of these. So this is in small and the white one is in large. And to be honest, you can't really see that much difference. The only difference is mostly here because you can wear it off shoulder as well. But I suppose the large one would be better to wear off shoulder or like on one shoulder. Um, I don't know why I bought large. I don't know if I picked out the wrong one or if they didn't have. I think they had only small in this and large in this and I tried them both and I thought they both fit so I bought them. And the lovely thing is they are quite cropped so because it's such a light fabric if you lift it up it's elasticated here it stays like this or you can pull it down and it stays down as well. These shorts are already getting bigger. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I really really love it. They do matching skirts with these tops uh, But I've told you last week that the skirt wasn't very flattering on me I think if the skirt was made of that eco vero fabric it would but it was Like two layers of this cotton so it was a bit stiffer and it made me look bigger in my hips Let me put the white top on now so here is the white top. Can you see it's much more see-through? It doesn't bother me. I've got brown. I suppose it's a bit bigger here and you see it's bigger that I can wear it on, on one shoulder or off shoulders. Yeah, it is a bit bigger. I can see that now, but um, it doesn't really matter, does it? Honestly, with these, the sizes, like I said, the first one was small. This is large, but I think they both look okay. All right, let me put the white dress on now. Good morning. So, <laughs> this is obviously another day. Uh, when I went to edit this video, I noticed that the end of it with the white dress had no sound. My microphone ran out of battery and I didn't notice. I could have done voiceover but I don't like doing those so um, I thought I'd do it quickly today I've just washed my hair I'm just getting ready so I'm going to finish doing my hair and then I will show you the white dress I will, I will also first show you this because I forgot about this top I will just do it on my vlogging camera I can't be bringing everything here again so I'll do that just quickly on my eyes I have the alter ego shadow kiss you know the dupe for Natasha Denona glam palette and on my lips I have the Lancome ideal lip liner I don't think you can get this anymore um, whisper lipstick from Delilah and tiny bit of Turkish Delight gloss from NARS. Okay, I will see you in a bit and show you this and the white dress. Okay, so I wanted to show you this slouchy top. This is, um, can you see that waffle type of cotton? 
something that you get from free people but this was from next so it's much cheaper it's just a boxy top it's got funny sleeves but you can turn them up i just love this type of tops for you know every day for just bumming around so you see it's quite boxy it's a bit longer at the back just really lovely and soft so i thought i'd show you that as well so now let me put that white dress on so this is a viola dress and look i'm wearing that necklace that silver necklace that pop up me it is a bit booby but you sh you could put another stitch if you needed to so this is lovely cotton it's lined uh here are the sleeves and look the sleeves have elastic here at the back so if you've got a bit bigger arms it's really nice to cover your arms and it's not going to feel restrictive here the same with the back it's got quite wide elasticated back it is so pretty and i just feel like they are made so well and have really really nice flattering fit so this one is in medium as well now there is a dress i think it might be the best selling dress which is called victoria and that dress they do it every season in different patterns different fabrics and it's the most beautiful dress ever so if you go on that website have a look search for victoria dress so for example in the winter they did them in like a very fine corduroy and they are a bit stretchy such a beautiful dress i tried it on i might insert a picture here although i don't think it looks that nice on a model but honestly that dress looked like it was made to measure for me it fitted so beautifully but it was from that um, cotton satin so and it looks very elegant it's got really lovely structured shoulders and i really wanted it but then i thought it's something that you would wear to a wedding maybe as a wedding guest or some occasion and i just thought i won't wear it enough so i didn't get it i might get it maybe in different fabric because they do victoria in cotton as well i don't know but i'm just so impressed with with the whole company um just the way the clothes are made the fit is everything i think is really beautiful so really this um, video turned out to be a guide to shopping at aspiga <laughs> i'm just so glad i went to that shop um because yeah i absolutely love their stuff i i'm not that into their shirts and blouses but the dresses and they do kaftans and tunics are definitely beautiful i have quite a lot of room in here but um i couldn't go for smaller size because of here but it feels it's quite flattering again because um this band comes up more like an empire line so again it skims over here i just feel that these dresses all the dresses are made to really flatter you so I feel like that was really, really successful shopping trip to Aspiga. Right, my lovelies, uh, I don't have anything else to show you. I don't think I should be buying any more summer clothes because we still haven't had proper summer. It's not cold, but it's not a nice weather for a nice summer dress. I suppose I could wear that today, but you know, like the strappy ones, the uh, Tabitha ones couldn't wear it right now but apparently we're having good weather coming in August so I will get somewhere out of them yeah. all right my lovelies I hope you enjoyed this video I don't even know if you can see me have I been just talking to you with my neck I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous bye